Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you so much for clicking my video. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss on any of my videos, especially as I'm covering the Law of Attractions. I am on the Law of Unwavering Desire. Law of Unwavering Desire is what actually kicks off Law of Attraction. So to basically fuel Law of Attraction, one must have a desire for something. One must be seeking something, whether it's love, whether it's, you know, happiness. Mine pretty much got triggered by love. I definitely had a desire to love. So that is what kicked it off for me. This law is strictly guided by pure intention. The intention must be pure. That's what you seek. That's what you want to become. That's what your desires are closely aligning to. Basically, if you desire something, you should stay in 10 toes down and have no doubt, no fear, overcome all obstacles for this desire. Find a hill and you're going to die on that hill. It's that serious, like it's very deep. If that burning desire is not there or if that, that sense of faith is not there, it's not going to work. It has, just like the last video I talked about everything being in a harmonious kind of way, everything has to be in line. If your mind is not where your body is if you go to work every day just because our physical body is there our physical element is there does not mean mentally we are there and you can tell this with people that you meet if you ever worked at a job where someone just feels disconnected or you just don't feel like all of their energy is there it's usually because their mind is elsewhere there's not a balance there's not a drive there's no pure intentions there and people can see that in individuals that's why a lot of times we have interviews we have things where we meet people and you just be like something was off something was just not right there has to be no sense of doubt no sense of fear for it to be a beneficial outcome and I say that because I say beneficial outcome you can have an outcome you can do the things that you want to do or you know go where the body leads you to go or go where the mind goes and the body doesn't even want to be there. That's a whole different story. If there's not a harmonious balance, then what we see is that unwavering desire law is not going to be met. And that unfortunately is why a lot of people don't feel like law of attraction works is because yet again, the faith is not there. The belief is not there. So everything has to kind of be in one traveling at the same kind of pace. And I know I talk with my hands a lot. I am working on fixing it. I really am. But it helps me talk about what I need to talk about. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Please, 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 if you haven't already, follow me on my social media platforms at That Girl Bonnie, where I release all mental health resources. Lately, I have been getting more into other pages too, so it's not just my page. So my page is also a page where you can find other pages. So. Please follow me if you haven't already. Thank you so much, guys. See you next time. Bye. Active by night.